Uh, hello, uh, this is my uh, iOS app feature explanation video and uh, in this video I'll be talking about uh, this app called Corona Tracker and I'll mainly focus on the map kit usage of this app. So uh, this is the GitHub repo of this open source iOS app and uh, let's get started. So first, uh, I'll show the app in Xcode, which as you can see is right here. Uh, there are different packages, or let's say uh, groups, called uh, like data, service, and uh, controller. These are very similar to uh, what we learned in class. And um, I'll then let me show the app in the simulator. And you can see it's right here. Uh, I can just quit to the home screen first. Oh, uh, it breaks somehow. But uh, yeah, but let's just, yeah, uh, rebuild it. Yeah, and uh, this is the very first scene that uh, we'll see when we first open the the map. So um, unfortunately, I don't know how to uh, zoom out in uh, on the simulator. So I'll just uh, try to slide through the the map. And as you can see, there's a map of the whole world with a different oh oh it builds finished okay yeah so uh as you can see right here the different color of the circle here uh indicates the total number of uh the confirmed case of the covid-19 you can see uh the us is pretty dark here um, and uh, so this is basically what this app does and it can also show up a bunch of uh, graphs. Uh, it keeps track of the total confirmed cases uh, in the world. Um, and it also split it into uh, different percentages it using a uh, new uh, package called the let me see. Yeah, uh, yeah, it's right here. It's called the floating panel. So basically, this is the floating panel. This has a very um, great usage above a map. So uh, let's explain how the map kit works. So first of all, after my uh, thorough research, I found out that um, most of the map logic is included here under controller and map right here and you can see in the map controller this is where the map is first initialized and used and uh, here you can see it defines a bunch of uh, IB outlet especially for this one the MK map view this is the map view, map view that we are uh, always been using. And uh, so I can try to switch to the main starboard. And you can see this is the MK map view that comes from the very first screen. Oh, sorry. Yeah. So get back to the code. And um, you can see the regular view did load stuff. Um, view did appear, view did disappear, but uh, the important point that I want to mainly focus on is right here, the map view delegate. So the MK map view delegate is the delegate that provided by Apple. Here, as you can see, it contains optional methods that you use to receive a map-related update messages. 
So here is basically how the uh, like how the the way of the map to interact with the user's operation is defined, and you can see this map view function and um, referring to the official document here is this function, and uh, this tells the delegate that the region displayed by the map view is about to change, and uh, it first. Um, have a guard which uh, indicates that the annotation is not the MK user location. So uh, it will make sure that the first load view of the map is the user's location. And there are a bunch of other methods. This one is called the map view did change visible region. And we can see it right here. The map view did change visible region. And this method tells the delegate that the map view's visible region changed. Yeah. So this is the function. And here, another map view. Uh, well, uh, you can notice that they both called map view, but they have different types of uh, parameter. So this one is the region did change animated. So if we if we go to the official document, we can see it's right here. So they both called map view, but this one with a different uh, name of the parameter is called region did change animated. So this one will tell the delegate that the region display by the map view just changed. So the difference is like this method means that the map view is about to change, but this one it means the map view did change. So and you can see inside of this function, it says map view dot zoom level is greater than city zoom level. Then it will start to add annotations and. Well, by annotations, it means different uh, country or city that will show up on the map. That's called the annotation of the map. And also, um, so one of the annotations is selected. So this, you can see it's still called map view. They all call it map view, but they are definitely have different um, types of the parameters. So as you can see, this one is did select, and this one is did deselect. So these two method, if we refer back to the official document, um, we can see it here. The map view, so did select here, and did deselect. So these two method, first one, the did select, it tells the delegate that one of its annotation view was selected. So it will update region screen. So what does this uh, function do? So let's look at first look at the select. So as you can see in this here, uh, if you select, yeah, so it will show up a uh, bunch of data including confirmed, active, recovered, death, uh, different numbers of the that related to the coronavirus. And if, let's say, we zoom in to uh, Chicago. So as you can see here, the state of Illinois. And yeah, if you click this, it'll show up the data that related to uh, Illinois instead of the whole United States. And this is actually defined here, the button mode tapped. So when button mode is tapped, yeah, uh, sorry. So uh, the button mode tapped is actually this one here. This will switch 
the data that shows on the map. So as you can see, uh, if we try to switch back to uh, Yeah. So if we change Yeah. Let's use this as an example. So oh uh this is a bad one. Yeah, right here. So now we switch to China. Uh we know that the China used to have a uh, like 90,000 of cases, but now they are mostly cured. So if we are select to active right now, we'll see not very bad. Only a bunch of small, like uh, yellow dots here. We'll switch back to confirmed, they'll become red. Yeah. And uh, so this is basically uh, the how the map kit was used in this app, and thank you.